lot of musicians are on small screens these days. And if you're on, if you just have a PDF on a small screen, you make it smaller. It's completely useless because you can't read anything, and you have to you spend half your time panning and zooming around. And it's it's like a photograph. It's not intended for the device that you're on. So on here, the notation actually wraps to fit your device. So if I make the screen smaller, it's going to say this bar no longer fits. Boom. Okay, now it goes there. So if you're on an uh, Android or iOS device, for instance, you might see something like this. If you're on an iPad, something like that. On a small screen, something like that. And then the other axis is you can just drag this slider to make the notation itself bigger or smaller, see the entire score. Now you may wonder if you're an engraver, well what about line breaks? And we deliberately throw that out the window because this is used by people learning stuff. It's not used for performance, so we don't care that much about uh, making sure the line breaks are in logical places so that you don't get tripped up during a performance. It's all about learning music and, and isolating specific parts of it, so I can loop this section, for instance, uh, and, and we prioritize making it work really nicely on smaller devices in the practice room.